Hi there, Jamie from Time and Space here. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the Akabono collection by Icebreaker Audio. So this collection of instruments is a fantastic emulation of an unusual Japanese synth from the 1980s called the Akabono Koto synth, which came encased in a suitcase as you can see here. The original synth featured a selection of traditional Japanese instrument recreations that you could play on a keyboard and it used a mixture of samples and digital synthesis to make these sounds, which gave it a very unique lo-fi tone of its own. The Akabono collection from Icebreaker Audio captures the original sound of this synth and presents it in the form of three different contact patches, each containing a selection of instruments from plucked to wind and percussion as well. All three contact patches come with a neat interface which we'll look at in just a moment, but first let's hear some sounds from the Akabono collection. As you can hear, a lot of great traditional Japanese instruments sampled from the unique Akabono Koto synth. Really fun to use and a very authentic lo-fi sound. Now let's quickly run through the interface. You can see the three contact patches on the left here, and I've got the plucked patch open at the moment. At the top we can select what instrument is being played, so you can see in this drop down there are nine different plucked instruments to choose from. And we also have the option to transpose everything down by an octave. For performance options, we can select to either control the dynamics using the mod wheel or keyboard velocity, and for the pitch bend mode, we can choose standard or authentic. And the difference between those are that with the authentic setting, the pitch bend behaves like the original synth and only notes that are pressed down will be affected, whereas with standard, all the notes are affected by the pitch bend. Moving on to the speaker section. This is where we have plenty of options to alter the tone of the instruments. Icebreaker Audio recorded seven different mic positions around the actual speaker in the synth, as well as capturing the direct sound. So we can blend between these depending on whether you want a clean sound or a recording from the original speaker. Finally, we have an effects page that features an EQ, echo, chorus, tape, and dynamic effect, which can be used to add a bit more crunch or interest to each instrument. Now if we take a look at the wind and percussion patches briefly, these behave the same but just so you can take a look at these six different plucked instruments on offer, 
and in the percussion patch we have 13 different percussion instruments which are already mapped out across the keyboard so you can play them like a kit. Finally, it's worth noting that the wind and pluck patches also feature two key switches each. On the wind patch, the key switches will trigger a tremolo effect, and on the pluck patches, they'll change to two different articulations per instrument. So that was the Akabono collection by Icebreaker Audio, a really unique collection of instruments sampled directly from the Japanese Akabono Koto synth. This is a lot of fun to play with, and I think you can get really creative about how you use it and implement it into your music. The Akabono collection requires the full version of Native Instruments Contact 6.4.2 or higher and will not work in the free contact player, but for any more information just click the link in the description of this video or head to timespace.com. Thanks for watching. Thank you.